Hello everyone, welcome back to the playthrough of Let's Play Skyrim Requiem with our character B. Tisha, the mage, who also now has a crossbow, which is pretty awesome. And I was doing some research before this episode uh, to figure out like how to level a mage, because I've actually never really played Mon before. Uh, so a couple of things I noticed was the... The next thing I put points into is alteration so that I can get the mage armor, which would be really helpful for me. Actually, let's just take a look here. Probably should have noticed it. Let's see. Um, da -da -da. Um, well, let's see what's in this tree here. Um, to augment spells, longer lasting. Ah, mage armor. Yeah, so it is in this school. And I, hmm, I just don't have any spells in it yet, but I'll, I could learn one. Uh, restoration, it was good I put uh, some stuff there. I probably could have used the point I used in Destruction and put it towards Conjuration. But that's no big deal. Fortunately, uh, I'm only level 3, so even though I could have put my, po my perk points in better places, uh, it's, it's just not going to be that big of a deal. I can recover from that. <clears throat> okay, so for this episode, well, let me just see what I have in my my arsenal. Wow, I have a lot of alchemical ingredients. I either need to sell these or make potions out of them cuz I mean, I only have 2 pounds of spare weight. I just don't... Mm, I don't know if I'm going to be doing any enchanting. I don't think Beatisha is much into that. But then for, you know, recharging staffs and all that, I might put some points into it. So I guess I'll hang on to the soul gems. Anyways, so we got a quest to take out the bandit leader here at Valtham, uh Towers. But there's something else that I noticed in my research... That'd be really useful is if I got the the mage stone and I got the blessing to increase my magicka, which would probably help me a lot. So I don't. Hmm, I guess I could take the little ferry to Riverwood, and then just walk, uh, activate the stone, and then go back to the tower. So I think that's going to be the objective for this episode: is to go to the stone, and then go to the towers. And take out the bandits. But for right now, I really want to get rid of all these alchemical ingredients. Either to, like I said, either to sell them or make potions out of them. Because I just, I just don't want to carry all that stuff around. And it would be really helpful if I could level up my alchemy in the process. I, I probably will find what I'm looking for. Okay, so do I have any magicka? Hmm, I do not. I don't have anything for that. I do, however, or I can make, oh, a healing potion. Yeah, but just one. I guess I'll get rid of these. Flamebane, pyrolysis. Stamina. Yes. Spell shield. I sell cures for all ills, and I'll be happy to see Wow, that Wow. This really increases your uh your alchemy level is that pyrolysis potion. So does this. Spiritedness. Yeah, why not? Alright, so let's sell this stuff. You look rather pale. Could be a taxia. Hmm. It's quite a problem back home in Cyrodiil. Take a look. A taxia, huh? Doesn't sound very good. 
Okay, so this is all the stuff. I don't need Poison of Affliction. Actually, you know, I think I'll hang on to those and use it on my crossbow. Although I'm pretty sure I'll only get like one use out of it. But that's okay. Um, I'll hang on to my potions of healing. Poison resistance. I'll sell those. Rigidity. I don't know, that's, that's pretty useful. Though it is taking up like four and a half pounds. But I'll get rid of it anyways. I could use the money. And still, I'm surprised how much money I have. I just cannot believe that. Let's see. Pyrolysis. I'll keep on to this. I'll get rid of the bone meal. Mostly just because it, it just weighs a lot. Imp stool. Oh, honeycomb. Actually, I need to... Here. Because honeycomb, I believe, heals. Oh, stamina. I, I lied. Let me see if I can make some more stamina. Yes, I can. Watch what you're doing. Sorry, what did I do? Was it this? Oh. You'll find oh my goodness. Sorry. So you're interested in my potion I just kicked that pot just like it was nothing. So I'm going to hang on to... Hmm. Wow. So I don't need any of these. Oh, she's not going to give me anything. Oh, well. Salt. I believe there is a property of salt that makes it really useful for something, but I don't remember what it is. I'll hang on to this for the Magicka. I'll hang on to this, I guess, for the Stamina. I don't need this. Lavender. Don't really need that. Imp stool. Yeah, I guess I'll hang on to that. Uh, but 45 red mountain flowers. Hmm. How many pounds is this taking up? Like four and a half? It's not that big of a deal. Bleeding crown. I think I'll hang on to this only because making the potion for pryolysis gives me so much experience in alchemy. And because, you, you know, it's good for leveling up. Um, affliction. Nah. I'll get rid of that. Anything else I can get rid of? Healing poultice is good if I'm sleeping. I can, you know, heal myself. Three points of health for two for 20 seconds. It's actually not that good compared to my other potions. So even though it increases my health, I think it's worth the trade-off. Stamina is increased by 40 points for 120 seconds. Restores 10. To One stamina for... Yeah, I'm not... Not worth it. Okay. So I think... I think we're good now. Yeah, she agrees with me. Okay, so let's go get to that stone. Okay, I wonder if the carriage goes to Riverwood. Because that could be pretty helpful. If I could just take the carriage there and then run to the stone. But then how would I get back? Hmm. And the Khajiit caravan is still here. I don't believe... I need anything. Do I need to sell anything else? Iron dagger. I mean, this is just... I wonder if I can charge it. No. Because I don't have any skill in enchant, so I can't, I can't charge it. I might as well start using some of these. Because why not? Also, some of you might be wondering about the portal stone in my inventory. This is actually for a mod called Familiar Faces, which is a pretty cool mod. I haven't really used it myself yet. 
But I'm planning to, yeah. Okay, so he doesn't he doesn't go to Riverwood. So now I'm wondering, should I just run there and then run back? Or let's see. Or should I just head to the towers and try it out? No, I really want the Magicka boost. I really do want that. Uh, now I need to take a stamina potion because I'm out of stamina. Oh, this is with a hundred. Oh well. Wow, I do not have a lot of stamina if that potion works that well. Okay, and this bow is part of another mod. I guess I'll go ahead and take it to Riverwood. The little fairy. I'll quick save just in case something goes wrong. Yes, I want to untie the rope. And where do I want to take this to? The east line. It's on the east line, right? Yeah, Riverwood. Okay. So... Now what do I do? Alright, just gonna sit in this boat. And... Wait. Now it's gonna ask me where I wanna go, right? That's... Is something on fire? Oh no, that's, that's the water. Okay, so... Is this broken? I untied it already. Oh well. I'm not gonna mess around with that. Guess I'll just have to head there myself. I forgot what Tundra Cotton did. Nope. I'm trying to think of what the other thing was that gives me pyrolysis. It's not that. Hmm. Sorry, I'm just trying to think what I can do. Um, Cause I don't really want to run all the way there cause that would just take some time. But I mean, it could be an adventure, so why not? What spells do I have? Nope, it didn't. Kind of almost did though. I also learned that little trick. Okay, what does this do? Stamina. Alright, so I'll take that. And why not? Yeah, I learned uh, that I was using my fire spell the wrong way. What I should be doing is just bursting it rather than just unleashing it completely because the damage over time will... I mean, it'll just do it regardless of whether or not you're actually continuing to cast it. So if you just burst it, it should, for one, save your mana, but also it'll just keep doing damage to the, to the enemy. So yeah, I was definitely using it wrong, because I was totally spamming it. Also, wolves, I hear you. Okay, there's two of them up there. All right, let's go. There's one. All right. There you are. Oh, close. So what do you got? Affliction? For how much it weighs, it's not worth it. Okay. So I just killed two wolves and I survived. I think that's pretty good. I think I'm getting better at this. So now I'm just gonna make it to this thing over here. Let's see what's over here. Oh yeah. A 
Is anyone here? Hmm. I guess I'll check this place out. Huh. This is a nice little a neat little hideaway. see what we've gotten here. Actually, let me eat these. And I'll eat this. There. It's in this end table. A roll of paper. That's not very useful. Oh, there's another door. Apparently it does nothing, I guess. Hello. Oh well. Okay, so let's continue our adventure, shall we? Let's get to that stone. So I'm wondering if the reason I couldn't, I couldn't get on the, uh, the boat and I couldn't use it is because I hadn't discovered these other areas, but then that doesn't make sense why I would have to do that. Like discover these boat locations, whatever. I'll try it on my way back just to see if it works. If it doesn't, then it's just a broken mod and you know, I apologize. If that frustrates you, then I'm trying to use a mod that's broken. Happens to the best of us. Just making sure I had the right spells up. Alright, so there are the stones up there, if you can tell on the compass. And I know there's a couple wolves around here. Somewhere, keeping my eyes out for them. So I'm still getting a pretty poor frame rate. I'm gonna have to look into that because it's starting to starting to bug me a little bit. I don't like producing videos that have bad frame rates. Oh, am I gonna aggro them? No, they're just gonna look at me. All right, I won't fight them if they're not gonna fight me. Let's just get to that stone. <clears throat> ah. La la la. La 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 la. La la. Alright. The mage stone. As your hand touches the stone, you can feel its powerful and ancient magic in every part of your body. You recall the tales about the mage. Those bearing his blessing are granted pure wisdom and an inherent understanding of magic itself, increasing spell casting powers greatly. I'll keep touching it. Ooh. Fancy. Oh. Wow. That's pretty cool. Okay, so what did I just learn? It's not under my active effects. Pretty sure it should be under... Oh wait, yeah, here it is. Granted additional magicka. So how much magicka did I gain? Wow, I'm with a 260. Did that grant me 100 magicka? Wow. Oh, well that was pretty worth the trip. I would say. So now I'm off to kill those thieves or bandits. Those people who do legally questionable things. I'm gonna get them. But first, let me 
Drink another stamina potion. So I can keep on running. You know what? I'm going to take on these guys. With a skeleton soldier. Huh. What? Come on, let's keep going. Let's keep doing this. Come on, come on. Get him, buddy. Ah, oh, man, you run so slow. And there's something over here. I don't know what it is, though. And this wolf. Psh. Here we go. I'll get you. It's okay. I'm not going to hurt you. Lied. Huh. Okay, so he's not going to come chasing after me. Yeah, keep running. I can do this all day. Gotcha. Yeah, like I said, I'm getting pretty good at this, I think. Just let me get to that east line thing, the boat, and I'll see if I can take that back to over by White Run, and then we'll go after those thieves. Yeah, might as well just get in the water. Another thing I would like to do this episode is finally activate Frostfall. I could do it through the mod manager menu. But I would rather do it the way the game designed it, which is I just look up at the night sky. So I'll, I'll give that a shot. Okay, so let's try this again. Okay, so it's untied. Now I just get in the boat. There we go. White run. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And the boat kind of took off without me, but that's okay. Just a little glitch, no big deal. And away we go. It's a nice little transportation mod. Just gonna go down the river. And I'm falling out of the boat. Nope, I'm not. I'm back in it. We're okay. And I'm still going. Okay, so... As you're passing through a grove, you see a man waving at you on the shore. I'm just going to ignore him for now. I'm kind of in a hurry to kill these guys. You know, I want to do a public service. A, a public service. I don't want to be bothered by people asking for help. My goodness. He's getting in the way of me helping society. Alright. Now we're getting ahead of those towers. Hello, sir. Okay. So these towers are going to be a ways, right? Oh, well, that's not too bad. That's about the distance of White Run to Riverwood. Ah, so I cleared out that place on the last episode. I still feel pretty good about that. Thanks to my crossbow. Let me make 
Never mind. Thanks, skeletal soldier. I guess you can go away now. I don't need you anymore. Ooh, another stone. I wonder what's up here. I'm tempted to check it out. Although, I can't really see what's over there, so I don't know. Oh, there's a guy. Looks like he's doing something. Let me just quick save, then I'll go check it out. Oh, they're hostile to me, are you? You want to be hostile to me? Okay. Oh, it's a lady. What are you going to do, huh? Oh, yeah? You want to do this? Uh, that's not the spell I meant to do. Oh, she's... Oh. Okay, alright. Is that... That's how you want to do it? I can do that. Where is my... Give me my crossbow. Oh, it's a necromancer. She killed my skeleton. Where are you at? I dropped my weapon. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Okay, let me just get my crossbow back out. You really want to do? You really want to do this, lady? Okay. Just make a quick change here. Never mind, I didn't need to change anything. Okay. So, how did I get up here last time? And why did my skeleton just run away when he saw her? Come on, skeleton, go get her. Go get her. Oh, she almost hit me. Why are you running away? Oh, did she use fear on him? It's not fair. The ritual stone. I wonder what that does. Ah! It's like one hit and I'm dead. Alright, I'm not giving up though. This lady's going down. What do you think you're doing? Huh? Huh? Oh, she summoned something too. Oh, it's an archer. That's great. Let me just get over here. Oh, I didn't think she would have hit me. How am I taking damage? Oh, okay. 
You know, you know what? No. I didn't start this with the plan to go to that summoning stone and kill that lady. So I'm sticking to the original plan. We're just going to those towers and we're going to kill those bandits. That's what we're going to do. Also. Oops, that was the wrong spell. Where's that wolf? There we go. Nothing to it. And I increased my restoration. Also, is there something increasing my uh, magic regeneration? Oh, my robes. Hmm. I guess I thought there was something else that was doing it. So by the looks of things, 654, I'll be attacking this place at night. Interesting. Sorry, just swap. I don't really know what's causing that. Oh my goodness. Uh, so, oh, normally I know these bandits, like when you're approaching, they... I like give you a warning? Apparently there's no warning this time. They'll just straight out murder you if they see you. I wasn't ready for you. Yeah. I'm not too upset by that. Also, did I save between killing the wolves and them? I did not. Well, I guess I deserve that. Just another thing about Requiem. Save, save, save. Really? Really? They're just gonna come right for me like that. Okay, that's all of them. Yeah. All the wolves. Done. I wonder if there's a restoration spell I can use to increase my stamina. Or, like, restore my stamina, I mean. Because that would be really awesome. Try this again, shall we? Take a stamina potion. Because I'll need it when fighting these people. And I'll go ahead and save it. Because I just need to do that. Alright, I'm going to try to sneak up. I wonder if this is going to work. Okay, I don't think they see me yet. Okay, they just sort of spawned in. Alright, now they see me. 
Okay, I've got Archer there, there's an Archer up there, one on the bridge, another one on the bridge. And a bunch of them down here. Whew, that was close. Okay. Get him. Yeah, your arrow's got nothing on my skeleton. Oh, oh, what? Come on. Also, my sword totally hit that guy. How did that not count as a hit? Huh. And my skeleton was spending his time gloating or taunting or whatever he was doing instead of actually fighting these guys uh, again. Thank you. Serpentine. Oh. Wow, he did not last long at all. Where right, you want to go? Let's go. Ugh! This is so frustrating. Is it, is it my approach? I wonder if I get if I get higher ground I could have a better chance at doing this. Let's try it. Changing my strategy a little bit. And plus, there are a ton of bandits down there. But I'm sure I can do this. I mean, I can do this. Come on. It's just a bunch of bandits. I'm going to get over there. Over to that rocky spot. Here we go. Okay. First things first. Let's try and take out that guy. What's the arc like on these things? Wow, that did like no damage. Cheater. He moved. You gonna move again? Huh? No? You're gonna go down the stairs? Huh? No, you're not gonna do anything. You're just gonna stand there. Okay, well, I got their attention at least. And... Wow. Oh, wow. I didn't even see myself die on that one. Alright, so that didn't help out. So I wonder if I cross the river here, go up there. Oh, that would make me pretty exposed for a while. But it's those archers, man. They're just getting me. There's got to be something I can do. Maybe if I just close the distance real quick. Maybe that would help. Alright, so I got one. And then a, a summoned wolf. Okay, so that's a thing. Okay, I'm not giving up though. I'm gonna keep trying this. I'm gonna try it till I get it. Let me see what items I got I can use to help me. A flame thrall. An, ex an exceptionally strong flame atronach that reduces its foes to cinders with animals. Yes. Alright, so you really want to do this, huh? You really want to do this? Here's what we're going to do. Raw Flamethrawl! Oh, they summoned one of their own. That's not fair. Oh, they just killed mine! What?! Oh, that is just ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. Okay, so I got to the door. 
So far, so good. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Dang it, wrong spell. At least she's missing. Did I just use up my... Oh no, I still have a ton more. Okay. Okay. We're doing alright. Let me see what you've got. Wine. What does this do? Ah, decreases magic and regeneration. I don't want to do that. Whoa! Is there another mage? Just gonna stand there and dance, or are you gonna help me out? Also, it's kind of dark in here. Oh, oh. Okay, there's arches up there. Okay, I don't want to do this. I'm just gonna save it real quick, just in case something really bad happens. Okay, so there's people running over here. I know there's arches across the way. Ah! It's okay, I saved it right there. Can they shoot me through here? Yeah, they probably can. But, uh, how do I get up there without getting hit? Oof. I mean, I guess I can do that. Whoa, there they are. Hello. And it's so dark now because it's nighttime. I can, like, hardly see anything. I guess that's my own fault. Ah, running the walls. Really? You're just going to stand there? No one's going to try to come after me? Whoop! <sighs> oh, this is so annoying, because now I just... It's so dark, I can't even see. I might just have to change my... Nope, that's not what I meant to do. I'll just up my brightness, just so I can see. Because it's just kind of ridiculous to do all this when I'm blind. Okay. Really? You're just gonna like summon a spectral wolf? I can do the same thing. Huh? What am I doing wrong? I guess one problem is my stamina is low. So. That would be a problem. This guy is stuck on a wall. So what can I do here? Let me try this. Ow, 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 ow. My flame Etronach killed me. Can you, like, move somewhere else? Okay, go up the stairs. There we go. Hey, you're getting there. Come on, move. Move farther up. Go up. Ah, uh, you're about to expire anyways. I'll just wait till that happens. It's like they just wait for it to die. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where'd you come from? Uh, 
Okay, so how am I going to take... Oh, take out these guys. And there's someone over there. Let me just get this ready. Really? Hey, how about you attack the guys attacking me right now? Oh, and I'm out of stamina. Great. <sighs> Where's the best progress that I made? And how did I do it? Gonna try something else here. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yep. Just keep keep shooting at me. Ah. Hmm. Ah. If only you would explode when these people come. Then that would just be that would just be awesome. What was that? Dang it. What is wrong? Can I just not beat these people? Hmm. God, geez, there's just like so many of them. Oh, why am I moving so slow? Move! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is someone gonna open that door? Oh, and I'm out of stamina, so someone's going to get me. Unless I can get to this water, then I might be able to think of something. Nope, couldn't get to the water. Do I have any stamina potion left? No. Firebolt. Huh. I could try that. What else do I have? I'll take that. This I can't use anymore. So what else? I so that guy said. So if I go either way, the arrows get me. If I stay here, then their little spectral wolf gets me. Okay, good. So he's got the aggro. And and this wolf. This wolf, yeah. Ah. Uh! Every time, it's the wolf that gets me. And I can't see the caster. How am I going to do this? Seriously? I can't even run away. Okay. I think I might have an idea. If I go underneath them, get to the other side. Okay, now what? Uh, no, they can still get me unless I go. <sighs> 
Okay, this is getting really aggravating. There's gotta be something I can do. Okay, so all I'm trying to do now is just get to where they can't reach me. And I'm out of stamina. Oh, man. And they're still shooting things at me. Uh, uh. <sighs> Did I bite off more than I could chew on this one? I think I might have. Really? I c you can't even see me. They're still shooting arrows at me. And they're probably going to kill me with them, too. This was the best idea I had. Was this. And it might still work. Okay. All right. So that worked out pretty well. Um, an orcish dagger. I don't even use the dagger that I have. Oh well. Okay. So who else we got here? Oh, come on! Seriously? I have a feeling that door's gonna open soon. Oh, it does. Oh, come on. The door wasn't even open all the way. Also, why did my flame attribute just like run out the door? Kind of screwed me over there, buddy. Whoop. Wait for that to explode so I don't get set on fire. Close the door. And now, I guess, I wait. Ah. <sighs> okay. I'll get that ready, because someone's going to open the door soon. There you are. Oh, well, you got a bandit. That's good, right? It's like one hit. One hit, that's all it takes. That's my margin of error. One hit. There's something I'm just not doing right. Maybe if I put a ward up, that would be better. But even then... Alright, let me see if they're gonna... Okay, so they're still shooting things at me. Ah, serpentine. Ah. 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 So I guess if they want to chase me all the way out here, then I guess they can go ahead and do that. No, my guy is still handling things. Oh, killed another bandit. Thanks, guy. 
I'll just let my stamina regen. Might as well restore my health while I'm out here. Okay. So that was the first strike, I guess you could say. I'm just going to do a quick save. I'm going to try this again. What are you doing? If you want to kill these guys, you know, like actually, I don't know, run after them? And now it is really dark. Alright. No, I already checked that guy. Who is the guy that just got killed? Someone was like just literally just ah, ah, ah. Where did you come from? Oh my goodness, that gave me a heart attack. Also, did my No my brightness is still up. It must be like just really dark right now. Okay. Just gonna watch this unfold. There we go. So he's going after somebody else. And now I cannot see because it's just way too dark. I'm just gonna wait till this battle ends. I'm just gonna see what happens. I'm just gonna watch it. And then I'll probably just rest until daytime when I can actually see. This is kind of amusing to watch. Though it'd be nice if he actually threw off a fireball, but clearly that's not gonna happen. Okay. Okay. So I'm just gonna turn my brightness back down to what it was, which I think was right there. And now I'm gonna rest until morning. Uh, ten hours? Yeah, why not? Oh wait. Frostfall. Right. This is how I do it. I'm just. Oh, uh, there we go. Lost in thought, you reflect back on how much the wilds have taught you about yourself over the last several days. You recall a book you once lost that was full of wisdom about survival in the open country. On a whim, you open your pack and find the survival's guide to Sky the Survivor's Guide to Skyrim staring back up at you. Had it always been there, or had thought alone summoned it? You push aside the thought as you thumb through the pages and then carefully place it back, knowing that some things are never truly lost. So I'm gonna read this book. As far as got the Skyrim. Da, da, da. Now, without any further deviation, let us discuss the subject of the land. Da, da, da. Cold road. Surviving frozen waters. Sand is for some reason. You know, so. got any gear for the journey. Axe. If an axe is unavailable, most of it is firewood. Out of the tent, you can always freeze and blue. It's finally from Okay. So that should activate Frostfall now. I'm just gonna go back to bed. Or not really bed, I'm just waiting. I'm just waiting for the end to come. When's it gonna start getting bright, huh? Oh, started getting bright there. Let me wait another hour. There we go. All right. So now I'm back at it. Gonna try this again. This is the end for you. 
Huh? I'll just take your stuff. Oh, my flame metro neck fell down. Whoa, you are well geared, sir. Whew. Not well geared enough. Okay. Oh, and you got some cooked beef for me? A feral wolf. Alright, I'll take this. I'll take this. And, uh... <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll take this. Why not? I'll even equip it. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate it. Ooh, tempting. Really tempting. Do I have any boots? No, I got my college boots. I don't have anything with armor, though. But I'm okay with that. You know what? Ah, this is fun. Oh, wait. Wow. You're a, you're a tough little guy, aren't you? Defend me. Oh, he just came right after me, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Maybe this guy will have better luck. You dare fight a mage? Boy, you got nothing. Wait, what was that? What just killed me? Oh, it was probably one of the archers. Yeah, that would do it. Wow. Did you get him yet? He sounds like he's in pain. Oh, I killed him. Awesome. Now I just have to go and kill everybody else. No big deal. Oh, wait. I'll just drink some water. Ah, so this is the bandit captain, huh? An iron crossbow. Is this better than mine? Damage 55, weight 9. Damage 24. But, oh yeah, the iron one's definitely better. So I'll just take that. Okay. Now I've just got to make it to the other side without... Oh, there's a guy right there. Seriously, you're running away from me? You're running away from me? Get back here! Yeah, that's what you get. Don't you run away from me? You just accept your death like a man. <laughs> uh, that was pretty funny. Whoop! Healing spell didn't really work for you, did it? Nope, it did not. Domination. Flawless victory. Ah, I feel pretty accomplished now. And that, my friends, is how you clear out these towers as a level 3 character. And, uh, yeah, without cheating, on Requiem. You're welcome. Let me just see what these do. Poison resistance. I don't know what that does. I wonder if I can... I wonder if I can make some potions right here. Oh, yes. Oh, Elves here. Perfect. Make a Magicka one. Stamina. It's not bad. Okay, now I'm just going to go back to White Run. And, oh, a chest. Okay. 
Alright, I don't have any skills in lock picking, so this might be pretty difficult. Oh my goodness. A novice lock is like a master lock. When you don't have any skills to put into it. So, it's not gonna work. It's not working. So, oh my goodness, really? Ugh. I'm all the way over. If I go up at all, it doesn't work. But it's so close. Okay. Just a little bit. Still no? There. Still nothing. Move it a little bit more. Still nothing. Oh, wow. Wow. This is one difficult lock. Maybe because I have no skills in it, I, I really just can't open it. Oh, you know what? I can break it. Right? Shouldn't I be able to break it? Forget it. I can't lockpick. It's just a fact of life I'm going to have to get used to. Wait, there's nothing in here. Why did I just do that? Okay, I'm seeing... I remember I saw an axe somewhere, like a woodcutter's axe. I'm actually going to need that now that I have frost fall up. You know what? There. That's what you get. There we go. I'll take that. I'll take that. Anything else of use in here? Garlic. Nah, I don't really need garlic. Another healing potion. Is there a chest up here? Nope. Just a chair. There's a bedroll. Not going to do me much good. Wow, so many bodies. I didn't even see these here. Huh. Wow, this is just ridiculous. <laughs> Look at all these bodies. Ah, oh, my flame atronach did some work. I'll take that for the journey. And that. And that. Thank you all. And that, my friends, is how you completely do that. There. Oh, I'm feeling pretty good now. Actually, I'm feeling so good right now. I think I'm going to take on that lady at the stone. Because I have a feeling her robes are uh, going to be pretty good for me. No, just better gear. Because right now... Um, increased magic by 30. Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking I can get better... A better outfit than this. So I'm just going to head over there and try to take her on. Oh, nice! The, uh, the woodcutter's axe automatically just went to the backpack slot. That's cool. Also, blue butterflies. Uh, I'll need you. Hello. Actually, I don't. I don't think I do need you. I need the other butterflies. I don't see any. Oh well. All right. So let's take on this lady, shall we? Let me pause it. Or not pause it. Quick save. 
Oh, you're warning me, huh? Remember me, lady? Remember me? Yeah, deal with that. Yeah, deal with that, lady. Alright, what do you got? Magicka regenerates 150% faster. That is pretty good. Also, here's a... What does this do? Human flesh. That's kind of morbid. Whatever. I'll take the spell. I'll take the robes. There we go. Alright, so what's this ritual stone do? It's powerful and ancient magic can be part of your body. Recall the tales of the ritual. Ever shifting and always changing, the ritual is known to be an unstable sign. But as it shines in this era, rumors have it that it allows the raising of the recently deceased. Interesting. This might be a good spell to learn. But I will save it. I won't do that yet. I want to learn this spell first. And I learned it. And I'm going to put these robes on. Because destruction spells cost 10% less. I think it's worth the trade-off to get better magic or regeneration. Alright, now it's off to White Run to turn this in. And get that bounty. Because if there's one thing I need, it's definitely more money. Actually, I do want to save up my money and get a horse. That's going to be like the first thing I buy is a horse. Because in Requiem, horses are just... Ugh. They're so nice to have. And I wish I could fast travel there, but I cannot. So if I could get a scroll of teleportation, that would be pretty awesome too. Alright. So I don't see anything bad about crossing here. There we are. There's some more blue butter. Wow, my frame rate. Ugh. There, I'll just take that butterfly. And there's some more over there that I need for healing potions. I need these type of butterflies, not the blue ones. So I'll take you, and I'll take you. I'll look another one. Thank you. Hello, guard. I'm pretty sure I can just harvest wheat. There. Give me your wheat. All of it. I'm a traveling mage from the college. It's okay. I can do this. Even though I didn't really finish my first semester, it's it's okay. You can just let me get away with taking your wheat. Ugh. Oh. I thought that was a mushroom. Probably not, just a spot on the log. Just a bump on the log. And I love it when you just randomly level up and you like didn't even do anything. Like like just then my evasion skill went up and all I did was just walk. That's pretty nice when that happens. Hello, sir. Excuse me. Ugh. I wish I could run, but I cannot. It's kind of sad, really. There, does that help? Yeah, that kind of helps. I'm still moving pretty slow. Excuse me, sir. Uh, 
Oh, man. This is like a quest in itself, just to get back to this guy. Come on, hurry up. I want to turn this in. stamina also what is that spell in the upper right what is that resist exposure oh because I had a hearty meal nice wow they're really trying to sell me on stuff aren't they nope I'm a mage I just want to get there, turn this thing in. Wow, another successful episode, two in a row. Two episodes in the row where I just do a quest, and that's it. Mission accomplished. I get my butt handed to me several times. No big deal. Oh, come on. Any day now. There we go. Whoops. I have returned. Divines bless you. May the ground you walk quake as you pass. Well, thank you. Yeah. The bandits are dealt with. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Well, thank you very much. Enjoy your visit to Dragon's Reach. I will. Might as well just stay here and warm up a little bit. I like these robes. They're kind of nice. Okay, so what's next? Hmm. What else is there to do? So I guess next time, I'll uh, figure out what's going on here. I'll work on this quest. And if that goes pretty quickly, what I would like to do next is... Hmm. I heard that there might be some nice gear for mages over in Helgen. But I'm pretty sure it's overrun by bandits now. So I might look into that next time. Alright. Well, thanks for joining me on this episode. This is Ben Beats playing B-Tisha. And I'll see you all next time.